will begin with a spin. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Janelle and this is Janelle Ray Budgets and um, it is Escape Room Monday. So I did miss last week. I'm sorry about that guys. Um, but here we are this week to do um, Willy Wonka. We're on the last two pages in the book. So um, then we will take a little bit of a break. Let's go ahead and pick our winners for the giveaway, which um, there was the hashtag was boys because my boys were in it. And um, so I just used them. Why is this not starting? <laughs> there we go. So our first winner is AJIW7XN and the old one is my favorite. I had asked what their what your favorite um Willy Wonka was and um she said the old one is her favorite but I have not seen the newest one. The one with Johnny Depp always amazes me because I didn't realize that Johnny that was Johnny Depp as Wonka because he looks so different. My son had the same problem if you guys watched the last video. He did not know either. He was like, that was Johnny Depp. Um, so if you can get a hold of me on Etsy, I will get you your code for winner. And then we've got one more winner. So Lisa Archibald, 1038. And she said, I've only seen the original and parts of the one with Johnny Depp. Okay, sorry guys. So I hope that my camera didn't stop recording in the middle of me picking the winners. But one was AJ. Oh man, I her screen name. I cannot remember. Um, hold on, let me see if I can pull it up again. Um, so we had AJ IW seven X N, and then we had Lisa Archibald um, one zero three eight. So, if you guys can get a hold of me on Etsy, I will get you guys your code. Um, my stinking dang camera. <laughs> this thing has given me nothing but problems since I bought it, and you guys are like super crooked. So, let's give you a little maybe straighten out here. <laughs> maybe. Okay, so let's see what our two codes were for this one so this one is of course Veruca our very 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 spoiled child um, Veruca and then this one is Charlie and this was from when he um, they drank him and grandpa drank the fizzy lifting drink <laughs> Which was, I, I found it really funny that they had to burp to get down. But yeah, so fizzy lifting drink. And now we are on to room nine, which is Mike TV's room. You guys remember. Um, so let me get my dice here. And let's just get started. So we've got four. One, two, three, four. So is, how is everybody doing? Um, so I did not film last week. Okay, so, <laughs> oh guys, my life. Um, my mother-in-law moved to town two, three, four, um, about four weeks ago. And so I've been trying to help her um, get settled and get everything moved up here. She lived in Texas. So um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, my husband wanted her up here because obviously she's getting older and she didn't have anybody down in Texas anymore. But anyway, so last Monday she had a slight little um, emergency type thing. Um, so I was, I, I was dealing with that. Um, one, two, three, four, five. So, um, yeah, it's just, it's been so hectic here lately. One, two, three, four, five. Um, I keep hoping that it's going to get better and then it just, and life's going to slow down a little bit, but then it just, you know, picks right back up. Um, so $5. So I've been helping her out and then let's see my husband. Um, I don't know if I've talked about this yet, but one, two, three, four, five, six. He got laid off from his job, so that's been a huge change for us. He is having a heck of a time finding work, um, so we are just, you know, trying to take one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, 
<laughs> take it a day at a time and see what happens. Um, I, I, I just, I don't know. Um, it's just been hectic. So you guys have been around for a while. You guys know that um, one, two, three, four, five, that life has been kind of hard on me the last couple months. Um, got strep, broken toes, husband getting laid off. Um, my printer, my printer breaking is actually what started the whole thing. So like when my printer broke and I had to delay shipping on orders, it just seems to be like a snowball effect since then. And I appreciate all of you so much. One, two, three, for the most part are just, have just been super kind about it and super understanding. And I completely 100% appreciate all of you that have been um, understanding one two so we're putting in two. Oh, so if I take back three and I can put it on five okay um, so I just I cannot thank you guys enough for being patient with me we are working so hard to get your stuff done um, my mom is oh, that was a four she one two three four she has been doing all of the cutting and laminating um, well, a lot of it, I do some, she does some. My husband has actually been helping put stickers on um, since he's been off. One, two, three, four. And so we are just trying really hard. Um, August binders went out today. Or not, I'm sorry, August. November binders went out today. So hopefully y'all get them before the first of the month. Um, I was trying to speed that up, speed it along so that, why am I rolling? There's only one left. So that you guys could make sure and have them before the first of the month. Um, so those will be going out today. All of them. We got all of them done. Um, so, let's see here. And then we need to put in three, I think it was, yeah. Okay, so um, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So um, another little um, bit of information. Let me give you your codes first and then I'll talk with the next one. So we have V-I-E-T-M-K. V-I-E-T-M-K. Okay. Those are your codes for this one. And now we are on to room 10. This is at the very, very end of the movie when they are in the great glass elevator that busts through the top of the roof when he says a Charlie one and he hugs him and that's just, yeah, I just love that. So um, this was one of my favorite, favorite scenes in the whole movie um, just because the great glass elevator, <laughs> I don't know, it's just... I, I mean, who wouldn't want to fly around in a great glass elevator, right? That can take you anywhere. So I just really loved it. Anyways, so what was I saying? Um, one, two, three. So I know that I post, sometimes I post new items on um, Etsy. So, or on Instagram, sorry. And I just want to say that I do come out with new items, but that does not mean that I am not still working on the items that need to go out. I, um, one, two, three. I spend a lot of evenings uh, when I just finally, you know, around whatever time it is that I finally have to leave my office because I just can't take it anymore. I spend a lot of evenings sitting on the couch designing new things, one, two, um, and coming up with new ideas. Um, so I, I do not neglect your guys' orders. Um, to come out with new stuff. Someone did say that to me and I just want to make sure that it is understood that I work very hard to make sure that I try, I'm trying really hard to catch up and um, one, two, three, but like I said with my printer breaking, it was like just a huge setback. Like it just messed up everything. So, um, but I do try really hard to make sure <laughs> I don't have five dollars that's okay well it'll even out in the end anyways 
Um, so I, I just want to clear that up one too that just because I have new stuff coming out it does not mean I am not working on your orders and I hope you guys know that I hope you know that in my mind your orders come first um, and I do pretty much spend <laughs> One, two, three, all day in my office working on orders. And then I just get a little bit of downtime at night before we go to bed. One, two, three. And that's when I do the creating. And then as far as the laser machine, um, it it sits back here. And um, I just set it, set it. And then I can pretty much just, it just does what it's supposed to do. And I go on and one, two. So yeah, I have been posting some binders, but like I said, it is just it is just sitting back there doing what it's supposed to do. So I think we have 20 in here now. <laughs> um, so we're gonna go with it. And then we need to put three. So one, two, and three. So I, I just I just wanted to make sure that you guys understand that I am not designing new stuff and coming out with new stuff over getting out the orders that I have. Um, I have to come out with new stuff, otherwise my shop, you know, once people buy things, they're not going to keep buying the same stuff. So if I don't constantly have newer items to put out, one, two, three, four, five, then my shop is going to flounder um, as a small business owner. That is all I am trying to do, one, two, is just trying to keep the newness and keep new stuff coming into the shop. But that does not mean that I am neglecting the stuff that I already have that I need to prepare for you guys. I hope that we, I, I hope that you guys know that. I really do. Um, so, this should be... 35 as well. So we have 25, 36, 37, 38, 39. What? 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. There we go. <laughs> okay, let me put this in the envelope and then I will give you guys your codes. So we have A K W N O. A K W N O. So also I wanted to say, um, and that is another $350 saved. So we are up to what? 1,050 now. If you guys are following along with me because we've done three books. So they're 350 each. So that's is pretty awesome. Um, wonk or uh, Jack. So Jack books are coming y'all. <laughs> They're giving me a hard time. Like, I'm having a hard time figuring out um, things that I want to use. So, I am working on those, like I said, at night <laughs> when I have a little bit of free time. I am working on those to try to design them, but they are giving me a hard time. Like, I'm having a really hard time with Jack. Um, these other ones were pretty, pretty straightforward and pretty easy, but Jack is giving me a hard time. Um, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, not Jack. Not Jack Skellington. But, um, so I'm trying really hard to get that one done so that I can get it out to you. Um, our next book is Alice. So luckily Jack isn't for a while. Um, those of you that purchased it, your labels have been purchased. I, I know that. I realize that. Um, please just know that they are coming. Um, they're not lost. They're not anything. I am letting you guys know that they are coming. Um, and as far as the rest of your orders, you guys, I promise, I am working my booty off to try to get these things out to you. And let's see. So now all of that to say that I wanted to show a few of these laser binders that I have been doing. So like I said, I turn on, I got the laser machine, so it is so much fun. Like I love it and I love what it does and the capabilities of it and what it can do. Um, so I turn it on, I pick a design and then I turn it on and I just put the binder in there, close the lid and it does its thing. Um, I check on it every once in a while, but it just does its thing. So this is a um, stitch binder that I did. So, um, it, this one, I accidentally bumped the machine when I was checking on it. And so it messed up right here. Um, you can see where it's off just a little bit, but I don't know. I might sell this one as like a mix up or maybe just give it away or something. But, um, yeah, so 
every single binder will have matching envelopes and I have one over here that has the envelopes in it so they will have matching envelopes to what the design is on the outside um, the inside looks like this um, my label my um, brand will be right here my logo on these ones it'll be right there and then yeah so this is the stitch one and I have different colors it does not have to come on blue um, I have a pink, well, you'll see, you'll see the colors over here. This one is one that is um, a sunflower and leopard print, sunflower and leopard print. And um, there's where my logo is. And so this is A6. So these are A6 sizes. This one is a Christmas tree one I did, and it's on the blue, which I think turned out really pretty. Um, so it's, it's the inside, they're all the same, but this is a Christmas tree one. Um, this one is a Disney binder, so it's got a bunch of Disney stuff, so it's got like Belle right here, it's got Snow White, Ariel, Pluto, Stitch, Bambi, um, Sleeping Beauty, it's got, uh, Tiana right here, the dogs, Mulan, um, yeah, it's just a huge, like, Disney, and then on the... Um, snap I put the word Disney um, so like I said these will all come with matching envelopes and matching trackers this is a nightmare before Christmas one I am looking for a different design for nightmare before Christmas because I didn't really like this one I mean I like it but I don't at the same time and I want the nightmare before Christmas to be on the front cover so I'm gonna move that if I do decide to use this design I'm gonna move it but I'm looking for a new design or I'm gonna design it myself which might be what I do um, so and then it can come in different colors and it will have matching envelopes whichever design I decide to go with this one is the hearts one um, this was the first one that I showed and it also has the envelopes in it so um, and then it's got my label on the back so this is the envelopes that will be in it. It comes with 12 envelopes and then it comes with 12 trackers. They are laminated like always so that you can use dry or um, Sharpie on them and then erase it. This one I just wrote groceries on. I was trying to show my friend um, what the, the envelopes look like. She's trying to get into budgeting and so I was trying to show her what you do on the envelopes. So that one will be available. And then I do have a five. So I have this cow. This is the cow and sunflowers, and he is just so cute. He's so cute, and I messed this one up when I did it. I flipped it over upside down, so I will have to um, flip it back over, <laughs> and then it'll be on the corner down here in the front. Um, I've only done a couple in the big right so far, so I haven't done a lot, and this one is the hibis hibiscus one and um the labels over here and yeah so this is the hibiscus one and it will have a um it will have envelopes as well um all of them have print on the the snapper snapper <laughs> so um these are mostly the colors that i have i think you can see all the colors right here this gray this pink comes in both the a5 and the a6 some of them are only going to be available in the small black is only available in the small the pink is available in both this dark blue is available in the both and this blue is available in both sizes i think that's all i have as far as these so far um, so if you guys have any designs, I did post a post or a story on Instagram about this, but if you guys have any designs that you would like to see, let me know in the comments down below. I got a few, um, Harry Potter of course is coming. Um, I will be doing a Harry Potter one. Um, I will be doing, let's see, a cat's one I think was one that was, um, posted. So I will be doing one of those. Um, I'm trying to put Jack on a black binder to see what that looks like. And then, um, uh, what was some of the other ones? I can't think right off the top of my head, but there are a few suggestions. So if you have any suggestions, I'll leave a comment down below with a suggestion and hashtag finished because we finished Wonka. And in two weeks, um, which will be the... Let's see, not the 4th, not the 11th, but the 18th, we will start Alice. 
in Wonderland escape room. So we will start Alice. I'm going to give a two week break so that people can catch up. And um, I will do the drawing for this though on the 4th. So it will be posted in my community tab and I will tag the winner. And so y'all, I think that's it. Um, thank you again to all of you that have been so patient. I appreciate you so much. And I um, am working really hard, you guys, to try to get these out to you. I just want to make sure that everything is done to standard and the way that I um, make sure that they are, you know, it's important to me that you guys get good quality. So that's why it might take a little bit longer, but I do work super hard to try to get these out to you. And that is all I got, guys. So we will see you in the next video, which I'm going to try to do a sinking funds video this week. I haven't done one in a long time. I've been stuffing my sinking funds, but I just haven't filmed it. So I'm going to try to do one. Mystery boxes, you guys. I don't know if you guys are interested, but mystery boxes will be going back up soon. I took them down for a little bit so I could do some inventory, see what I have. I do have a new binder that it will be available for that as long as well as some new um, little stuff that goes in them. Um, I will be posting some videos of that here coming up soon too. So be on the lookout for those. And... I think that's it guys so oh what what was I gonna say oh there is one more thing um December binder was put up it will not go up again until after we get them shipped out I cannot have any more December binders bought because we are trying to get everything shipped out or caught up and shipped out um before I go on vacation in November um but we want to make sure especially that we have the December binders done so that you guys can get them by the beginning of December Next month in November, when I release our um, escape room binder, it will be the first time that the expansion pack for the January binder will be available. It is a expansion pack and it will be a brand new listing from the old listing. So those listings will no longer be going up. Um, none of the mystery binders will be able to be purchased um, again until I get, you know, a few of them up. So um, now they are closed for now. And then next month, the first expansion patch for the January binder goes up. If you had not bought the January binder, but you want the whole thing, it will be an option to buy the whole binder and the whole binder will come with 16 challenges in it. So the expansion pack and then 16 challenges if you did not buy it. So that will be the first thing that will, that will be what goes up next month, um, will be the January um, expansion. Yeah, but anyways, it will go up next month along with the escape room. Um, I have not decided what escape room I'm doing next month yet, so I can't give you any hints. Um, is that it? That is it now. So I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys have a wonderful, had a wonderful Monday and I hope you guys have a good start to your work week and we will see you in the next video. Bye y'all.